want to walk down the gorge. I want to die. No, no, no. When I get there, just push me. Right. Just push me, bro. Challenge accepted. Yeah. Ah. Well, let's get the parents. Best pair, best pair of team. Oh, yeah. Get it, let's go. <laughs> it's still going down. The legs are shaking. No, I'm not sighing, bro. Look, Sa uh, look, look at what they are saying here. <laughs> it said, <laughs> I acknowledge that I'm aware the consequences of an accident whilst rafting on Zambezi River can be serious. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is more like kayaking, but uh, more like a dangerous kayak. <laughs> Good morning, how are you all doing? Uh, today is actually my last day in Vic Falls. I was supposed to leave last night and somebody actually challenged me that if I don't do water rafting in Zimbabwe, which means that I never came to Victoria Falls. So I felt like, you know what? You know, I need to challenge myself, but I'm not that guy who loves adventures. Is it, is it scary? Uh, not that scary, man. I mean, have fun. No, I mean, I've seen water rafting videos yeah. and it's not fun at all. Very fun. But I'm not a swimmer. Do you think it's advisable? We do take people who are not swimmers on the river. This guy is giving me some confidence vibe, man. And the youngest person we've taken on the river was five years old. Ah! If a five years old can do water rafting, then I'm doing it. I was told that this is the best place to do water rafting in yeah. the whole world. In the whole world. And I'm from Africa. <laughs> Today, I must do it. Whether you guys like it or not, come along with me. Listen, pray for me. <laughs> Pray for me. Pray that I come back because listen, everyone is saying that you can't go. You can't go. You need to do water rafting. And listen, Zimbabwe is giving me all these memories. I'll make it happen. I trust these guys, man. Please make sure you're always behind me, yeah? <laughs> Just in case of anything. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Alright. Morning. Morning, how are you? Great. Are you are you ready, you ready for it? No. No? But do you think I need to do that? Yeah, exactly. Well, why, why, why is it so necessary to do water rafting? Uh, because it's more fun and more action. More fun and more action. more action. Let's go and have fun and do some actions today. Probably it, it's an exercise for the muscles. Okay. That's what I read. Let's go. So we just arrived at the Victoria Waterfall entrance and we're supposed to pay how much? $10 national park fee. Okay. To enter into the national park. It, this is different from the price that you're gonna pay for the raft, right? Yeah. So if somebody is, like after my video, somebody get inspired, I don't wanna inspire you to come and do water rafting though. <laughs> <laughs> no, <that's not> <laughs> yeah, but if, if you get inspired and you wanna do this, yeah. how, how much is the fee for water rafting? Uh, it's $150 okay. per person. Yeah. Together with a ten dollar or uh, total of the ten dollar? Uh, one hundred and fifty dollars for the rafting, then ten dollars national park fee. Okay. Yeah. So together you're paying a hundred and sixty. It's time to go do the payment. Right. There. This is exactly the same place we paid when we were going for we're going in here. Uh, inside the waterfall. A big shout out to Shock Waves for making this dream come true. If you ever get inspired to go for white water rafting, the only company for you to go with is Shock Wave. But listen, before you go, you definitely need to sign your death sentence. Man. Inside. No, in. I'm not signing, bro. Look, Sa uh, look, look at what they are saying here. <laughs> it said, <laughs> I acknowledge that I'm aware the consequences of an accident whilst rafting on Zambezi River can be serious. Jesus Christ. <laughs> But look, there's a five-year-old rafting. Did you see the baby that's rafting? The five-year-old kid. 
if that five-year-old baby signed this, I'm signing it. <laughs> I'm signing it. <laughs> I'm signing it. Now a whole grown guy now is afraid to sign. Bro. Five year old. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> What's today's date? Thirty the first of July, twenty twenty two. Yeah. By the way, guys, this see, is. See you in first of August. Don't mind the truck. Ah, so funny. Bye bye. Bye bye. from the National Park entrance. Uh, yeah. We are now going to the top of the gorge now. The, the top drive. of the gorge? Yes. Remember we need to walk down the gorge. So ah. We drive into the top. No, I don't want to walk down the gorge. I want to die. <laughs> Eh? Awesome. No, no, no. When I get there, just push me. Right. Just push awesome. me, bro. Push Challenge me. Accepted. Challenge accepted. Challenge yeah. accepted. <laughs> so the Whoa. drive is about uh, 20, 25 minutes. Depends who's driving. Okay. It's me, 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> A fast rider, eh? So it's 10 kilometers on Tad Road. Mm. And then uh, we go off road on a dust road for about 4 to 5 kilometers. So we'll finish our drive inside uh, the National Park. Okay. We here, eh? Yeah. Oh <laughs> my god, oh my god. Please don't leave anything in the truck. Oh my goodness, I like, can uh, I'm really not ready for this. But I just have to do it. We only live once. And sometimes you just need to face your fears, man. This is the national park, right? Yes. We are in the middle of the national park, which I think it's not safe to be walking in here because a lion can just jump on me right now. <laughs> But yeah, you see, more cars are coming. Some things are for white only. You guys should leave something for white people only, man. They love adventures. I've never seen us loving adventures like that. <laughs> you see? Love adventures, man. Oh, cool. So who is not coming? No, 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 no. Yeah, he's not coming. What are we gonna use this for? You know, when you're in the water, you know, you, you go like this. Hoop. Hoop. Yeah. You see, when I'm doing like this, you see, just like Saza. Vanish. Yeah. Saza, Saza. <laughs> when you're making Saza, eh? Hey. We're gonna make Saza on the water. Saza on the water. Do you also have Saza in Ghana? No, but we have similar food. Okay, guys, go for some helmets. Right after this, he said you are done. Can I go back home? <laughs> You're not going back home yet. Uh -huh. All right. Hey, guys, make some noise! Buddy. Too late, buddy. This was the scariest moment of it all, knowing that you cannot go back. And the safety precaution made me scared. And to be honest, I really wanted to give up. So when you're pulling somebody back into the ramp, who is a short swimmer, you do not pull somebody using his arm like this. Uh, we have to take the advantage of the points of the lap track. If I push you down, when the lap is trying to pull you, to, cut, to pop out, uh, the then you become very loud. Right. As long as you listen to your guys, everything will be safe. You're a good swimmer, bro. Yeah, we are. Yeah. So, Try and save yeah, your yeah, best man. <laughs> you see, he is your best man, Terence. <laughs> Hello, guys. Terence, he's your best man. He's like, uh, you guys, after you listening to the safety you guys, I feel you like not doing me. this anymore, bro. Because ah, like, it, 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 it sounds so scary. I don't know why I'm doing this. I don't know who forced me. But come along with me. I, I think sometimes you just need to face your face and do something. This is really a great 
adventure, man. I mean, descending down the gorge, it's not easy. Like, it, it looks so scary making sure uh, your foot are on the right place, are the right place. Because, yo, man, somebody just fell right now. My legs are even shaking. Like, you won't believe it. Like, I've never done anything like this before. I love traveling, but I don't like doing things extreme like this. But I feel like, you know what? Since you're on a journey, bro, sometimes you gotta face your fears, you know? I mean, traveling alone is like facing your fears. I mean, sitting on the plane every single day from one country to another, it's very risky. I mean, personally, I don't enjoy flying at all. So, yeah, if you can do that, I think uh, you can face your fear and do everything. You just have to be brave, believe in yourself, have a positive mindset and make it happen. <laughs> Forgive me, but I'm just trying to inspire myself till I get there. <laughs> Hey, hey, I need to inspire myself before I get there. All right, so, yeah. My legs, my legs are shaking. <laughs> my legs are shaking. Yo, we're still going down there. This is giving me a vibes of uh, Kilimanjaro, man. Let me just put away the camera before I fall down. about stowaway and the people that wants to cross the Mediterranean Sea this is how I'm gonna feel like man. <laughs> I'm not I'm not yeah, I'm not, not me I don't want to go to Europe I want to go to another African country so I'm, I'm doing stowaway from Zimbabwe to Zambia whoa look at that I'm excited even though I'm scared but you know we only live once let's go experience this for the first time And it's time to practice before we go for the real adventure. Let's go forward. Excellent. Stop. Thank you. Now, the next command is left turn or right turn. This is whereby we want to spin our boat to the left side or to the right side. So when I say left turn, the guys that are sitting on the left side, you pedal backwards. While it's the guys on the right, they continue pedaling forward. You will see our boat will spin to the left. Okay? So let's go left turn, back on the left, forward on the right. Right turn, back on the right, forward left. Excellent. Everyone get down, get down, get down. 
Get up! Get up! Get down! Get down! Get up! High five! Yeah. Yeah. Guys sitting on the right side, please stand up. Then guys sitting on the left side, turn around and hang your feet in the water. Turn around. Make sure you see Namra here. Away to the camera. Away, away, away. Excellent. Back to your position. Yeah. Alright. So the name of this uh, gorge that we are rafting in is known as the Batoka Gorge. Batoka Gorge named after the tribe of the Batonga people who are usually found uh, in this canyon doing some fishing on both sides of the river. So river left when facing downstream, it's Zambia. River right, it's always Zimbabwe. The river is the border between the two countries. So today, if you fall out and swim, and uh, you end up on the Zambian side, no worries, you don't need a passport today. We don't give immigration people down the river. He's not allowed in Zambia. <laughs> Alright team, let's go forward. Alright, yeah. I'm Liberty, my name, okay? Right, I'm gonna be your lifesaver of today. Right, if you can see see my car, he's got one loop at the front, then one loop at the back. If you are a long swimmer, I come straight to you. Okay? I'm gonna ask you to hold on to my car at the front. Number 13, the mother, and I'll ask you guys to get down. Get so down? To, yeah, get huh? down and hold time. Okay. You remember to get down. <laughs> Alright, we'll get down. And hold this, right? Yeah. <laughs> so 12A, level 3. Everyone, get down, get down, get down. Hold on. 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 trying to convince me but you know the power of a woman there was a woman who actually convinced me yeah. so she has been doing this all her life and i'm like if you have done it i'll do it too and here we are here we are baby yo it was so much fun so much fun and eh? you buddy i made it alive bro i was not expecting it but yeah and if you have never experienced this you have to do it before you die man I'm not sure if I'm alive or I'm in heaven. <laughs> Am I still alive? <laughs> really? Yeah, it was amazing. Amazing trip? Yeah. Hello. Hi. How was your trip? Good. Good. Good night, Jack.
telling you, bro. The best part of it all is the rafting. But climbing up here is not fun, bro. Don't try this at home. I'm sorry. But yo, it was so much fun, bro. I love to do this over and over again.